Hi and welcome to a Kirby Maths video all about factorising quadratic expressions and in the first of these videos we're going to look at all positive signs in the question. So for example if we have x squared plus 7x plus 12 and we are asked to factorise that that means we want to put it back into the original double brackets from which it was expanded. In order to do this, we need to look for two numbers which add to give 7 and times to give 12. Now because all of the signs in this expression are positive, we don't need to worry about um, manipulating the signs and it is always the number in front of the 7 which is the sum, so they need to add to give that of the two numbers and it is always the number on its own which is the product so the two numbers need to multiply to give that answer and this is where we start we start with the factor pairs of 12 so the factor pairs of 12 are 1 and 12 2 and 6 3 and 4 and then we look and see if by adding the factor pairs together we can make the total 7 and in this case if we add 3 and 4 we get 7 and if we multiply 3 and 4, we get 12. So our factorised expression becomes x plus 3, x plus 4. The pluses are because these are both positive. And that is how you factorise a quadratic expression. I'm going to do two more examples so you can see how it works. We have this one, x squared plus 6x plus 8. We need two numbers that add to give 6 and times to give 8. And we always start with the factor pairs for the timesing term. So the factor pairs for 8 are 1 and 8 and 2 and 4. If we add 2 and 4, we get 6. So I'm going to select these two. They're both positive. So the factorization is x plus 2x plus 4. And finally, I'll do one more example. If we have x squared plus 8x plus 7, we are looking for two numbers which add to give 8 and times together to give 7. <coughs> Excuse me, now 7 is a prime number so it only has one factor pair and that's 1 and 7 and fortunately if you add 1 and 7 you get 8 so factorising this we get x plus 1 x plus 7 and because the um, order in which you multiply things doesn't matter you can multiply 3 times 4 and it's the same as 4 times 3 you can write these brackets the other way around so this one could be written as x plus 7 multiplied by x plus 1 and similarly you can swap these around the important thing is the sign with the number inside the bracket okay thanks for watching